An early morning fire near Park Rapids claimed a historic building at the Vacation Air Resort. Our Josh Peterson has that story. What would be considered a beautiful day in the North Country is a day that has left many in shock. Hours after an early morning blaze, flames and smoke continue to rise from the ashes from one of Vacation Air Resort's oldest buildings. Only three of the 12 units in the building were rented. However, one of those guests was sent to the hospital for their injuries sustained during the fire. Super thankful that everybody made it out um, and is okay relatively. Um, there's somebody in the hospital right now, but we'll be okay. The fire started around 5.20 Friday morning towards the middle of the two-story building. Mutual aid was requested by the Park Rapids Fire Department, where 30 firefighters spent five hours putting out the flames. We arrived on scene roughly probably 20 minutes after the call. Got there, was fully engulfed, um, called mutual aid, called three other fire departments. Went strictly defensive. It was basically couldn't save it. While the building is a total loss, many neighbors and guests stopped by to take a look at what was once a beautiful country building. Many of those who stopped offered condolences and support to the Clancy's who own the resort. We have a lot of support and super thankful for that. Um, just um, thank you to the community and our friends and family and everybody that um, supported us and keeps supporting us. Um, super thankful for that. For Vacation Air, losing a building that's decades old is a huge loss of historic charm. But for the owners, they are already looking forward to rebuild. You just can't... Um, uh, rebuild something that uh, with that natural wood and um, the old style look and just um, it's it's devastating it's you know from the 1930s or 40s so with the loss of history for the Clancy's comes a chance to rise up from the ashes and build new memories we plan to rebuild for sure yeah definitely in Park Rapids Josh Peterson Lakeland News Clancy's Bar and Restaurant and a five-bedroom villa remain open at Vacation Air. Authorities say the fire appears accidental in nature, but the cause remains under investigation. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.